we are live hello and a very warm welcome to all the guests and viewers who have joined us today on youtube on the eve of the international day of persons with disabilities which is observed every year on 3rd december the observance of this day aims to promote an understanding of disability issues and mobilize support for the dignity rights and well-being of persons with disabilities Atal Innovation Mission, Niti Aayog, the flagship initiative of Government of India, aims to promote innovation and entrepreneurship in the country and is organizing an exclusive YouTube live session today on the eve of International Day of Persons with Disabilities to initiate a conversation on the theme for this year, which incidentally is also very relevant. Transformative solutions for inclusive development, the role of innovation in fueling an accessible and equitable world. The session today includes great speakers, distinguished speakers who come from different spheres of the ATL ecosystem as well as outside the ATL ecosystem who are trying to play a very significant role in making a great shift in this. Uh, we have with us uh, a distinguished guest today. We have Ms. Madhvi Lata, who's the former national para swimming champion. She's also founded an institution called Yes, We Too Can. She has done a lot of initiatives and is herself a great inspiration and example for everyone. We'll hear about her story, but apart from that, we have an ATL student, Onkar, with us. We have an ATL in charge, um, Mr. Ramesh Vannapalli with us, and we have an ATL mentor of change who's been working also in the same direction, uh, Mr. Srinivas with us as part of this conversation today. We'll hear about all their experiences giving us different perspectives into how we can actually make this a more equitable and accessible world. We have with us Mr. Dr. Chintan Vaishnav, Mission Director, Atal Innovation Mission. And along with him, we will initiate this conversation with our um, distinguished guests and uh, participants for this very special YouTube live session. Atal Innovation Mission has constantly been making efforts towards making the Atal Tinkering Labs also a space that is more inclusive and a space where more and more children with special needs are able to innovate, express themselves better and create innovations for a better future for everyone. Our students are also innovating for their peer groups when it comes to assistive tech and we've had great success stories in that as well. Now, without further ado, let me invite uh, Mr. Srinivas, who has been a mentor of change with Niti IO Battle Tinkering Labs. He's been working extensively with students. He's been working with teachers who are differently abled. Uh, Mr. Srinivas, share with us what motivated you to take up such an initiative. It's so important and people like you are playing such a significant role in changing this whole landscape for us. Please share with us your uh, journey and experience. Sure, madam. Thanks for giving me this uh, great opportunity. So I'll start from here. Like, uh, you know, I think you all can hear me. My dear, uh, I just wanted to greet like uh, my Onkar kind of students, my dear young innovators and tinkers of the nation. Firstly, I greet you all to be a wonderful world-class innovators. Friends, according to me, innovation is the future and future is looking for innovators. Having a problem is not a problem according to me. Having no problem is the biggest problem because we miss opportunity to solve the problem. So let us welcome our societal problem because we are social beings. We are in society and definitely we are humans with brains. So definitely we have to welcome those societal problems and solve the problems. So that is our, our personality to be raised. So that is possible with our ATL labs. At the same time, uh, to get solved uh, through our innovative solutions. On this special day, International Day of People with uh, Disability, I don't really say disability, it is specially ability. I can say it's an, another opportunity for all and equally we get opportunity to work with us and uh, we wanted to together work so that uh, uh, today we are okay, but tomorrow we don't know. So definitely there, should, there must be some solution. So uh, we all have to really work with various solutions for different differently able people. One way, I am proud to be mentor of all our children, uh, nation through, uh, through uh, my Atal Innovation Mission. The mentoring network, which really inspired me a lot for building innovative ecosystem through our ATL, non-ATL schools. With all my tinkering experience, what I have gained is creative and critical thinking 
which is uh, many, many innovations may uh, my local to global problems. Once Albert Einstein said, I mean, imagination is more important than the knowledge. So now this is the time for all can innovate through imagination under the umbrella of our ATLs. So with all my lifespan of four decades into innovations, I felt myself that I must share all the power of innovations with all my young innovators so that our real, real heroes, your heroes are my tinkers who can innovate the things, are the one who innovate and be part of solutions for all the pollution and problems. Lastly, if we don't solve our own problem, who else can come and solve our problem? from other planets it's not possible because as of now nasa also declared they haven't found any another planet to be so that we have to save planet here that's where so uh, with this uh, you know uh, so let us do third part i mean I, I used to do third part my childhood if any relative comes to my home next day his watch won't be there because that night it is undergoing for third part so i mean the break and make and all that because without breaking how we can get the making thing and making knowledge and all okay so that is the third part and all we need to do so an idea can be anything as long as it solves some problem doesn't matter whether it is a small or big so a three years old kid came for me my home lab and then he is the one who told me about this he is a uh, uh, Charvik from Bangalore now he is at four and a half years old I think so so anyone who are interested they can browse his uh, YouTube channel Charvik science yeah. so because of his particular given word that idea can be anything small or big doesn't matter as long as solving some problem so that's really interesting so today we we think that we are uh, all right, but tomorrow uh, ages comes up, then uh, many issues may arise. Uh, so we don't know. That's what I heard a lot many things from today's video watching through our madam's uh, channel. So have to consider and prepare solutions for various other purposes too. So uh, today my knee pains are not there at 50. Doesn't matter. Maybe at 55 I might get started. So I have to have a solution for that. So a lot of children were working with Dr. Kalam. They have invented and innovated and Kalam sir promised uh, that I will come to your home and uh, uh, visit all that. But by the time uh, he, he prepared to go there, but he is not there with us physically taking rest at Rameshwaram. So uh, as we are thinkers, uh, we can do wonders in making innovations. So let us work together so that we can make, I mean, not only India, I always used to feel proud. My I, while I'm working on networked computers in the United States, I used to feel, uh, you know, my India. Then suddenly I used to uh, use my marker pen and mark that I for red. So my boss told me, what is this? All the time you are missing your India. I said, no, my I is India. India means all full of intellectuals. So today, our innovative India towards productive India has to say, uh, takes place. That's where I am a part of our mentor network. And uh, at this point of time, I just wanted to share one or two innovations I worked with specially able people. I can say that Divyangs, my Divyangs. So one with the students and one with the teachers I wanted to share. See, Sarvendriyanam, Nayanam, Pradhanam. This is very important, organ. We have many organs. So there are many problems. But first thing is, as uh, in Sanskrit it is said, Sarvendriyanam, Nayanam, Pradhanam. So if at all uh, growing children at school level can't be properly checked in time, I have come across a great personality, eye specialist, who is the chairman of uh, World Ophthalmology uh, Association. I have talked to him uh, along with Dr. Kalam. So at that time he told me, so whatever eye power is lost in a kid by negligence, that can never be brought back. That is the highest dialogue he gave me. Then I told, okay, what else when can we do? He said, we can only prevent it. How can we do that in a periodic checks? So this is the place where our all ATLs can be put onto a platform where every single kid of the school must undergo in a frequent way that our automation will take place and the data will be collected. What what are the errors? Is the vision 6 by 6 or 6 by 5, 6 by 4? What's going on? So this is where one area we have to help a nation with the proper eyesight. At least first eyesight is proper and rest of the things can be proper. So healthy children, healthy nation. That is one area that one input for this because time is very kind. Otherwise I can share many, many more innovations area that we can all work together. But another area recently I've come across because I am a power electronics man. So last four years I'm working with renewable energies. So what happened? My, I am a part of Thana, Telugu Association of North America. So many of Thana people have come in this month of December. We'll be doing a lot of activity uh, supporting social areas and social problems. So what happened uh, four years ago? Uh, so Thana people told me, can we help uh, the Vyangs, like uh, those who cannot move? Then I said, okay, anyway, you people are donating tricycles, okay? 
but i said no simple tricycle is not going to help them because for far off distances they cannot really pedal it then i said why can't we design uh, you know ev ev for uh, tricycle the first idea which i gave to them immediately they started making and supplying fine no problem so i just gave it to one of my teacher veera babu from our atl school is there jphs veera varam so there is one atl school from there he works there so what i did so we uh, gave them that particular ev uh, tricycle to him and next after four days he called me anaya anaya means a brother so <laughs> anaya i can't drive this ev why is that you know i can't keep the charge your charge uh, helped me for three days fourth day your charge is not helping i cannot take this vehicle inside the school or inside my home for charging this is a problem you please come and collect it then i said no don't forget about it where there is a problem there is a solution we will do something then immediately i started designing a power converter because any solar plate will give you only 12 volt level but that ev fellow has designed the entire vehicle for 36 so i have developed an up converter for that immediately connected up converter for charging so kept a 150 watt panel on his ev tricycle and after that he is happy is cool and he can leave the ev wherever he wants after that that fellow will keep charging once it is charged and again for four days it go now he is happy he can always park it wherever he want because he want to charge so he cannot take inside home because he cannot push or pull so this is another wonderful solution with renewable energy just one way is a message other way is more comfortable earlier he is only helping one school children now he is re- reaching four or five nearby community schools and helping everywhere what about atl how atl works how tinkering works how innovation all these things well explored by that veer babu i am so That's happy so, uh, that is a really yeah, wonderful thing great, I, uh, thank you so much yeah. for sharing that and in fact thank you for making atl a hub of innovation yes. truly a hub of innovation yeah. so innovation and, is only future and, that's yeah. one thing so with this what i wanted to tell once again in last 30 seconds mm-hmm. i is not only innovative and uh, inventive india and uh, i can tell you i is not for import my i india must start now export why import when we can export our atls are only the ones the root cause like they they are the ones who can really come as an entrepreneur so in my childhood i don't have atls but yeah. today the reason i am into atls only for one reason whatever i missed in my school days that should not be continuing to the next generations so today is the place where they can play a platform to play with innovations so i must really thank atal innovation mission uh, so i can tell make in india made in india skill india at school india through atls is possible that is one really statement i wanted to say thank and you I, so much and uh, so much. and lastly really? lastly from my side uh, we all know that jai jawan jai kisan and jai anusandhan our prime minister sir also said but at the same time uh, we can also you uh, add something into the same like um, uh, jai innovations <laughs> <laughs> and uh, jai jai my atal innovation mission jai ho uh, so with this uh, definitely so i am there with all the uh, problems of our divyangs and i wanted to do whatever best tinkering possible for them and let the problem come from any part of my country and through our any atl i wanted to help my children give them solution and help them the design and they are the ones who tinkering it so that they will come at the product that must go entrepreneurs at that area must go so on this special day this is my input thank you for uh, giving me this uh, opportunity uh, to share with our md sir thank you sir thank you thank you so much mr shrinivas and i am not going to come to your lab with my watch on that is for sure <laughs> i might not get it back <laughs> madam for that point if i connect uh, you know my this session through this phone and then if i show you my lab space then definitely will say you will come <laughs> <laughs> okay i said i'll come without <laughs> my watch of innovation is there the place where i am now <laughs> so i'll definitely feel yeah thank you thank you